Well, we've all heard that simple acts of kindness can go a long way. At Nasita High School, one teenager's selfless act made this the best year yet for one of his fellow classmates. Our Jamie Perez shares their story of how doing something good made all the difference in the world. Draven Hallam's relationship with his dad, Jake, is a bond unlike any other. But in February of this year, life took a devastating twist after Jake lost a five-year battle with brain cancer. And there was a lot of um, suffering and a lot of heartache. Draven's uh, mom, Julie, knew how hard this would be on Draven going into his senior year. He was my biggest role model. He was my everything. In a video that Draven has never seen before, Jake said his final goodbye. You know, just so you know, I didn't ask for cancer. Sorry, Julie said facing her fear of raising her kids as a single parent was tough on her too, but found some comfort in Jake's final words to her. You know, you have people around you that love you and will support you. Little did Draven or Julie know, that support would come right here at Nasita High School. As a parent of a child with special needs, you don't know that your kids will get that opportunity to have those magical moments. Draven was nominated to be in the running for Homecoming King, but at a pep rally, his classmate Jaron won the title. It was really honorable for me to be, like, voted for as Homecoming King. But little did Draven know, Jaron would put another twist in his life in front of all his classmates. They gave me my sash. I asked for the microphone, and I said, can I make an announcement, please? And I said, as honored as I am to be homecoming king, I would really like to give it to Draven. Everybody went crazy, and Draven, I called Draven down and put the sash on him. When he gave me the title, it was magic. But this magical moment brought on a mix of emotions for Julie. And I thought maybe at first I was sad that his dad wasn't there and sad that he missed the opportunity to see this. But after I thought about it for a long time, I just felt this huge sense of relief that we have this whole community of people that can support us and lift us up in you know, our darkest times. Draven knew his everything was watching over him in this moment. I do know he would be proud of me. Before any of this, Draven and Jaron were simply classmates, both of them not considering themselves very close friends. So I had to ask. Why did you do this? I know Draven wanted it more, and he deserved it more. If Jaron only knew that he fulfilled a promise that he never knew was made for this family. So for Jaron, he sort of fulfilled that promise that Jake gave me that people would be there to support me and help me. Oh, it makes me feel 100 times better than actually being homecoming king. Congratulations, Draven. Your dad would be so proud. In Nasita. Something you'll never forget? Never. I'm Jamie Perez for News 3 Now. It was just incredible. Incredible is the word, and thank you, Jaron Murphy, for doing something good. If you have a do-something-good story that you'd like to share with us, send our newsroom an email, and we have a link on how to do that on our website, channel3000.com.